Hello friends, and happy Easter. We know what that means, don't we? Easter eggs. They're delicious. But this year, I was thinking, let's get something a little bit meatier. So, we're going to make what I'm calling the Meatster Egg. So let's take you on a magical little ride. First, we kick things off with bacon, five eggs, potatoes in the pot. Get everything cooked up, son. What else were we going to do here? Remove the bits of the eggs that we don't want to eat, leaving the hard-boiled goodness underneath. Bacon extraction skills. Add milk to the bacon and potatoes. Now add some turmeric powder. Smart. We mash everything all together with unorthodox mashing it. Because that's how we roll. Tastes good. We need to get some ice, and where better to get it from? Ice is getting hammered tonight. Chili surgery underway. We slice the tips of these suckers twice. We fixed them two baths. First a hot water one, then an ice one. We saved the chili juice aside for something special. Drinking chili juice. <laughs> Spicy. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we got some aluminium foil. We got to work crafting the only kind of nest that's suitable for one such as the meatster egg. A nest made out of metal. Now we get a giant meat sandwich. One and a half kilos of mince. Some corn crumbs. Just about a whole packet of them. Curry powder. Some paprika for bite. Some gram masala, good thinking. Some eggs, ninja eggs that want to hide from us. Feels good on the hands. We gave our nest a meaty lime. Build up the sides monster is starting to take shape. Add some cheese lining. Then the custom mashed potato. Of course, this is a nest, so we have to put some eggs in that one sucker. Bury them in more of that mashed potato. Smart. Now we seal the deal. No need to play nice here, we beat that thing into shape. Put it into its nest again, give it some last minute touches. Then into the oven for a bit. We gave it a turnaround halfway through. Egg tried to hatch on us, but we had a backup plan for that. We gave it a mashed potato tube. Fill in the holes, put the thing back into shape. Egg needed the shell anyway.
back into the incubator for round two. Our chili flowers didn't open up as planned earlier on, so I decided to give them a helping hand. Next, we get to work cutting up some bacon strips. Fry those little bad boys up. Then we cut the cheese, and in a good way. Use the cheese and the bacon strips and some bread rolls. Do custom hot cross bacon buns. Our meat's doing itself a bit of an accident and lost shape. Got a little bit of garnish and it turns out all right. Here we have three different kinds of animal. Pig, cow, chicken, mixed with cheese, add the potatoes. Yin Yang Harmony. This is it. the Meat Direct.